Oh, yeah. Aspen, for sure. Um, all right. So we're doing America's, uh, America's tier? Yeah, we're doing America's tier. All right, let's blow these fuckers up. Just bust out the bull whip. I know, right? I, I don't. Dude, I, I got to tell you. The weed is working. Let's see. Who we got? Who we got? Um, okay. Um, there we go. First, first, first impressions. First impressions. Because remember, even if we know who these people are, I'm judging, I'm just judging them on their hotness. This is pure ableist objectivism. Nothing matters about these people other than how do they strike me? <laughs> I love doing these. Um, there's not a whole lot to work with in this batch. I got to tell you. It is. It is a looks tier list. This is this is this is a hundred percent hunt hunt bunch of potato looking fuckers. Uh, I gotta tell you, we got a whole lot of ones probably. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be difficult. Are there? I don't. It isn't a free and voluntary exchange. It's a coercive system. If you don't have the capital to pay for your health care, your food, your your housing, um, that's coercion. Legally def defined. That's coercion. Capitalism capitalism is inherently coercive. The the system of privatization of, of these commons is coercive. The the it's just the the fact of the matter is, yeah. If you want to have a philosophical or an economic discussion or a legalistic discussion around this topic, the fact of the matter is, is that capitalism is inherently coercive. Holding that sort of Damocles above our head of homelessness, of destitute, yeah, yeah. That's that's the definition of coercion. The whole system is coercive. It's got to be thrown out. It doesn't it doesn't meet the uh, ethical framework framework for an anarchist. That's we we have functional problems with it we have ethical problems with it we have utilitarian problems with it anarchists hate capitalism it's 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 a constant point of our critique it's just disingenuous to be a capitalist and call yourself anything but um let's see i don't know a lot of these i gotta be honest with you i knew the middle eastern motherfuckers a lot better like the african and the middle eastern guys um all right what do we got here what do we got all right. Yeah, I don't I don't know this mother yeah, this motherfucker right. Yeah, can I get my cursor up there? Yeah, I don't know this motherfucker. I think I know this motherfucker. I mean this uh wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. I mean, I know who this is. This this doofy looking motherfucker. It's fucking it's straight up neckbeard looking milady fucking hat tipping motherfucker. Dude, this is Castro. Um <clears throat> I dude, I don't just remember that one from the history books. That's Mexico. That's Diaz. Um, no, no, no. It can't be Indonesia because it's Americas. Che, this is Americas. Sash. Um. Yeah. Um uh where's yeah, that's Pinochet. That's Pinochet. Um fucking uh that's or that's Ortega. That's Ortega. That's Ortega. Um and let's see. Um Oh dude 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 fucking I'll come back to him. I don't uh fucking this is uh baby doc. That's fucking baby doc. That's the most recent. That's Haiti. That's Haiti. Uh, I don't remember it. Dude, he's got the French name. He's got the French name. I I, I forget. I forget his stu It's a French fucking name. 
Uh, but that's that's Baby Doc. Yeah, that's that's fucking Haiti. Uh, all right, top row, floor from left. Oh, all right, yeah, I see it. Cool, cool. Duly noted. Um. All right, let's see. I keep looking up because it's bigger on my top screen. <laughs> I've got it on, on this screen, but it's shrunk down, so I keep checking up here. That's, um... That's Perone. That's Perone. So, yeah. Yeah, that's Perone. Um, and, um, fucking, that's, um, Douchebag. Um, Maduro. Maduro. That's Nicaragua. Uh, Nicaragua. It's Venezuela. Fucking Nicaragua. <laughs> You're lucky we're not calling you Mexico. Um... I don't I don't know Hattie McGee. I don't know him. Uh let's see. Okay, that's pretty much all I know. Yeah. Yeah, that's all I know. All right. Let's rate these motherfuckers. Now. Oh, I don't know, Zippy. I'll have to consult the cheat sheet. I'll have to pull the files and give them a look to know for sure. Um... First, third. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, but how hot are they? See, this is the problem. There aren't any lookers in this crew, all right? There's no lookers. But I will tell you right fucking now um, that Pinochet, I mean, he's got the swag, yo. Look at that shit. Like, he's kind of baller looking. Right? I mean, cre credit where credit's due. He's got the look at right, at least. Does porn become more ethical when the featured performers pass? <laughs> um, this is this is rough. This is rough. Let's just let's just get this let's get this done. Let's get this done. I don't know who the fuck you are. <sighs> uh, not a fan of Jeff Goldblum here, but I mean, Jesus Christ. Um, Woody Allen here. No, I'm good on. <clears throat> I don't know what to do with you. God, he looks like he's just going to bring too much stuff to bed. <laughs> she's gonna be, dude, imagine getting him out of this uniform. Jesus, goddamn Christ. Gee, there's going to be a thousand fucking la layers. Oh. Let's see. I, you know, I, I don't think Perone is all that, frankly. I think he's kind of doughy looking. He looks soft, despite everything. 
I juice scissors. I know, right? So much fucking work. Okay, you know fucking baby Doc just lays there. You know he's a fucking terrible lay. Look at him. He's a terrible lay and you know it. Fucking. This motherfucker right here. Yeah. That's, that's fucking, um, Ortega. Um. He looks like he'd put in the work at least. It's probably going to be an angry fuck. Like a really angry fuck. But it looks like it could be a decent fuck. Like he's going to put in some work for you at least. <laughs> uh, I mean, you know. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? I don't, I don't know who this is. I think it's Grenada. I think this is the dude from Grenada. I don't know who the fuck he is, but I'm pretty sure. I, I just, I remember the smiling black dude in the fucking military cap. It's just, that's, I don't, I think he's, I think he's Grenada. I think you're going to get a good dicking out of both of these. I think you're going to get a good dicking out of both of these. That's, that's, that's what that's coming down to. This guy doesn't even look like he, I, I don't, I don't know what's going on here, but he looks like he might be confused. What's up, champ? Yes. Yes, yes, Che. That Grenada. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's Grenada. I don't remember his fucking name, though. All right, let's deal with it. Castro, you fucking neckbeard, maladying, fucking... Absolute... Dude, this... You know this... Um, these... Okay, uh, Chimp, these... Uh, my community sometimes creates... Uh, I am... Hi, my name's Kai. Um... Sometimes I like to be a catty gay. Um, and so they like to create like tier lists of like dictators and war criminals and shit like that. These are um, the uh, the best dictators and strong men from the Americas. However, uh, the, the, the community member that created this defined that. And I rate them solely on whether I think how they look, how hot they are, whether you get a good like, lay out of them or not. Completely objectifying and uh, like minimizing the the and hi I'm an anarchist by the way you know it's a fun time it's it's the night show grab a beer grab a smoke um that's Trudeau's dad yeah yeah, yeah. oh yeah that's Castro yeah that neck beard looking motherfucker that's Castro hundred percent yeah I don't even need to like that's 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 fucking Castro yeah. Yeah, try and throw me a fucking younger photo of Castro so I don't, f you think I've slipped that by me. No, that motherfucker, that's Castro. That neckbeard looking motherfucker. I swear to God, he, he always looked like he'd be the fedora wearing fucking katana carrying motherfucker. Yeah. Fucking milady. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Dude, dude was, dude was always a fucking neckbeard. <sighs> All right. Maduro, <laughs> Maduro, you're dumb looking ass. I don't, I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. All right, so here we go. I wasn't finished with Castro. I think Castro, I like. Look, I can only work with him here. He's young here. He he doesn't have the moves developed yet. Old Castro could probably put some fucking moves on you here. This guy, this guy doesn't have a lick of experience at that point. He's gonna be awkward and shaky and shit. And it's probably going to bust a nut inside three seconds. So, you know, fucking... But you get to say you slept with Castro. So, he'll get a three out of that. Not at this point, he doesn't. Not at this point, he doesn't, Zippy. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. This, this Castro doesn't have cigars and rum for you yet. <laughs> you're going to you're gonna have to wait. You're going to have to wait a few years for that Castro. 
<laughs> oh, Maduro, you're fucking soap opera looking ass. I don't know what to do with you. Um, I don't know if you'd even get any action out of him. He looks like he might be another layer. Like he 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 is he's like baby doc over here in Haiti. Like I think Maduro might have just fucking laid there. He, I I get the I get the distinct feeling of objectifying the objectors, right? I you know gorilla. I know right. Fucking fair play. Look, I'm I'm all for I'm, I'm a humanist across the board. I'm for equality. Look, if we're not going to get rid of the authoritarians completely, can we at least see some diversity in them? I for one would like to be oppressed by a gay woman for once. I know, wouldn't that be so refreshing if we could just, you know, yes, girl, that all the way, that boot heel? I want that boot heel to be sparkly and fucking bedazzled. <sighs> Or we could um, <clears throat> do what we need to do to the, all of these. Um, let's see. Yeah, Maduro's just gonna fucking lay there. More female dictators. Yes, exactly. All right. Uh, our duplicate here. You know what? This guy's kind of got something going on. He's actually decent looking. He's also kind of got an intensity to him. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. You see, people, I'm somewhat of a feminist myself. He's in the spanking. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? He looks like he'd just be happy to be invited. He'd probably put in the effort just for being invited. I... I mean, look. I'm sure... His parents are proud that he graduated summa cum laude from a technical school. Uh, he'll go on to <laughs> go on to found a software company, um, and he'd provide an excellent living for you. But I'm just not digging it. It's not. It's not. It's not working for me. Now, I, I think he might be happy to, like, be invited to the party, as it were. So he's not, like, the lazy fucking, or, like, straight up, I, this dude's a rapist. I don't know what this fucking, this dude's deal is, but he's a fucking rapist, I'm telling you right now. And I ain't putting up with that. But, uh, you know, so he's not, he's not going there, and he's not going the, like, what the fuck, stay away from me level. Um, uh, I think he's just going to be mediocre. He's Ted Cruz. Yeah, he's Ted Cruz. He's Ted, he's he's sort of yeah, he's got sort of a Ted Cruz vibe. Um so like I, I you know No, god no. Prone, you at least work wear this wear the uniform well. Credit where credit's due. Oh Jesus Christ, Rev. <laughs> uh <laughs> all right I, I don't dude i when i mean this dude's like japanese or some shit what the fuck is this who i mean peru's got like asian influence um who could he be I, dude, my shot in the dark is Peru, just because I know en just enough about Peru to know about the, the Asian influence in their society. He's Fujimori, the neoliberal dictator of... Uh, Fujimori. He's Fujimori, the neoliberal dictator of Peru. I just... I know Peru has, like, a bunch of Asian influence. It's, like, you know, because of, like, my favorite dish is Lomo Saltado. And it's it's got soy sauce in it by default like that's that's it's got cilantro and soy sauce and so it's got this like you know and potatoes 
And so it's it's got the indigenous uh, South American. It's got the the influence from uh, from above in Mexico and Central America. It's got lime and like a green sauce, and then it's got um, soy sauce from the Asian immigrants that came to Peru. Um, and so, like, yeah, I know just enough about Peru to be like, I shot in the dark. Asian dude is Peru. Interesting. He's the neoliberal dictator of Peru. Fujimori. Hmm. Uh, the total blind spot, total blind spot, but, um, yeah, he kind of feels like there. He's a bit out of my age range, but I'd give him a fair shake. <sighs> he's gonna, he's just, I don't know who he is, but holy shit. I don't want him anywhere near me. Um, I just, I, uh, yeah. Yeah, like this, I don't, it, it just, no, just no. I just, Jesus Christ, this guy's so sad looking. This guy's just so fucking sad looking. <laughs> oh. Yeah, the, the mustache guy looks violent and non-consensual. Yeah, no, I don't feel safe with him in the room. Uh, <laughs> oh, I don't. Okay. Look, I've already established lots of gear and you go in the bo bottom bin, right? Like, I'm sorry. If I have to start cutting off your uniform to get your fucking dick, you got to go. So that's, that's a given. Um, I gramps down here. Like this dude just got grandpa vibes. It doesn't matter age. This dude just got like grandpa vibes. Now I'm not opposed to fucking banging grandpa, but Ah, uh, I just, he does not, he's just not entertaining. I don't know. Yeah, he's, he's definitely, yeah, I kind of feel that sort of, yeah, that vibe here. He's a 1950s perv <laughs> for Zippy. Uh, all right. There are too many people with non-sexy grandpa vibes. He got robo dildo vibe, robot dildo vibe. All right, I don't, dude, I don't know. This is okay. This guy's this guy's creeping me out. Maybe because there's two of them, or maybe just because he's creeping me out. I've been looking at him for too long, and now he's just starting to like stare into my soul from the beyond. I don't know if this motherfucker's dead or not, but like, fuck it. What's up, Cat Cube? Thanks for the fall. Um, mustache guy? Mustache guy is Videla, uh, leader of the military junta in 70s Argentina. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, definitely some non-consensual shit going on there. Um, <laughs> um... I, this guy's creeping me out, man. This guy's creeping me out. Um, all right. <laughs> he looks so sad. <laughs> I figure, I figure, uh, I figure we could, uh, like, help his day along he seems like he seems like he could use a pick me up <laughs> all right creepy motherfucker uh uh hey old friend one hunter two nobody can see you're not you're not in chat so you know you've been shadow banned. <laughs> oh. Let's see. So, who are we at?
have a feeling he's gonna lay pipe though. Something about uh, something about him says to me. We pound coin, yeah, yeah. It's it's bang ability and in, in, initial hotness impression and that sort of thing. Yeah, hundred percent objectification of uh, of dictators. Yeah, like throw throw out whatever you fucking know about him, and just we're we're just the vibe. And you, are are they bangable? Do they do they get your engine moving? What do they do? Is that Jordan Lee Peterson? <laughs> Shoot, man. <sighs> yeah, that feels right. So what this tell is telling me is that Kai will fuck out of fear. All right. So let's figure out what I what I fucking I, do. I do I want to make any changes here before we fucking do this? Okay. I'm happy I'm happy with that list. I'm happy with that list. I mean, they're all kind of shit. But pound coin do oh something else let's see uh, a couple of years back at Folsom Berlin nice um, a couple I knew tr uh, decided to dress as a Brit royal in the full red military dress and his chauffeur footman in the traditional gray uniform even how the Rolls Royce do it uh, doing some dominant submissive class play stuff but when they turned up at their hotel, the hotel thought they were legit actual UK royals and laid out the full red carpet and shit. They got all sorts of freebies and special treatment. Yes. Nice. Nice. I don't know, man. I don't know. What are we? Oh, just wanted to say. All right. Let's just call it. Let's call it. Let's call it. All right, let me try and figure some of these motherfuckers out. All right. We know for sure this is Pinochet. This is Pinochet. <sighs> Hudson Austin. Hudson Austin. He's, he's Grenada. I was right about Grenada. The name still. Hudson Austin. I just remember photos. It's just vague memories. Uh, who is Starry McGee here? El Salvador. He's El Salvador. 1931 to 1934 and then 1935 to 1944. He is Brigadier Maximiliano Hernandez Martinez. Okay. El Salvador. Got it. That's Ortega. That's... um. Nicaragua uh, 79 to 90 and then 2007 to present fucking fucking yeah oh yeah dude South American sometimes the South American dictators get like five seven names going and you're like god 
Damn, that's a name. Um, all right. Carlos Mancheno Cajas, Ecuador, 47 to 47. Oh, Jesus. He did well, I see. <laughs> he did well. Oh, who's sad boy? Guatemala, 31 to 45. Jorge Ubico y Castaneda. Sad boy is Guatemala. All right. Who's smiley grandpa over here? Albert Henry, the Cook Islands. All right, you little motherfucker. You little motherfucker. The Cook Islands, you little... Wait, let me guess. You got some fucking... You do. You've got some, like, Tonga and S Solomon Islands and Samoa up in this bitch. Oh, you little motherfucker. That's why I have a, like, we're not even, our brains aren't even in that part of the world. We're like, where the fuck, who is this motherfucker? Oh, you sketchy little fucking attorney. I regret nothing. This is Marcus. <laughs> all right. All right. Um, okay. So Smiley Grandpa was Cook Islands. Albert Henry, 65 to 78. Um, we got Perone here. Uh, Juan Pedro. Uh, fucking. Uh, so yeah, we got, uh, we got fucking Peron. When was he? 46 to 55, 73 to 74. Okay, cool. Um, why am I not seeing crazy here? Uh, there he is. Honduras. Oswaldo Lopez Oriano. Uh, Are those two L's? Or yes, yes. Uh, Os uh, Oswaldo Lopez Oriano. It was Honduras, sixty-three to seventy-one, seventy-two to seventy-five. I love the repeats. Um, let's see who's who's Jeff Goldblum here. Oh, music. There we go. Um. Oh, Brazil. Uh, fuck it. How do I fucking say this crazy fucker's name? Um, Hale. I think it's Hale. Uh, Hoe. Either way, uh, Figueiredo. Sorry for butchering his name. He's fucking Brazil, 79 to 85. Yeah. Um, uh, he, yeah. Fucking, I'm not even going to try and say this goddamn name. Go fuck yourself with this shit. What is this? I'm putting it in chat. I'm putting it in chat. This is, this is some crazy shit. I, I'm sorry. That I, 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 there's no point of reference for me. Within my within my capacity, <laughs> as a as a native English speaker, I take one look at that and go, "No." Twile epa se elele malele ago. I dude, I just I just murdered a language. I just murdered a language. <laughs> Fucking. Uh, say it like it's Spanish. <laughs> oh, oh, it's Samoan. I think beast. I'm pretty sure it's Samoan. It says Samoa 98 to 2021 attempted, attempted dictator. I, we have to, we have to, right? Like we have to, how the fuck is this name said? Alright. Somebody's just gotta say his name, right? Somebody's just gotta say his name. Yeah. Nope, don't care. Just somebody say this fucker's name. That. Thank you. 
Nope. I give up. Somebody else find it. <laughs> I give up. Somebody else find that shit. Uh, yeah, streamer perks. It's like I, I'm, I'm fucking yeah. Don, Don skis. We already know who the fuck. The, oh, sorry. Fucking, we already know who the fuck this idiot is. This, 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 uh, this neckbeard looking motherfucker who guaranteed tipped that fucking fedora at least once in his life. Fucking, that's, that's f good old Fidel Castro. Oh, no, it's Raul. I'm sorry. Fucking, it's, uh, Raul Castro. Jesus Christ. Um, fucking, that's daddy. Um, my comrade. Now, who is, um, Who is this guy? Joaquin Balaguer, Dominican Republic. Oh, it already was Aspen here. Here it is. There's the name. First 10 seconds has it. Thank you. Company. All right. One of the ones I just skipped over and didn't collect. Company, His Excellency. Assembly will now hear the address of His Excellency Tuilaipa Salieri Malelie Gaoi, the Prime Minister and Minister. Go fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. Minister for the address of His Excellency Tuilaipa Salieri Malelie Gaoi, the Prime Minister and Minister for Foreign Affairs. <laughs> Wow. That's a fucking that's a sound. Oh, that's his that's his full name. That's his full name. Thank you, Che. His full name. His full name right there. S s uh, you know, you know, I'm just going to I'm going to let the person who's apparently practiced at this do this. His Excellency Tuilaipa Salieri Malelie Gaoi, the Prime Minister and Minister. His Excellency Tuilaipa Salieri Malelie Gaoi, the Prime Minister yeah. and Minister for Foreign Affairs. Yeah. No, those are sounds that you can make. Those are sounds you can make. That's, that's, sorry. That's all I got for that. That's all I got for that. That I, there's, there's no way my mouth is capable of producing that. Nope. <laughs> Not even going to try. Um, yeah, Alberto uh, Fujimori, Peru, 90 to uh, 2000. Yeah, that was, um, that was a name. That was a name. Jesus, goddamn Christ. Whew. Like, I feel like that took something out of me. Like, I feel like a spell was cast or something. Jesus Christ. The fuck Harry Potter shit was that? Um... <laughs> All right. Um, who's this Woody Allen looking motherfucker right here? Sir Colin Hamilton Allen, Solomon Islands, 76 to 78. He definitely looks like he's from the Solomon Islands. The fact that he's knighted. I shouldn't read anything into that, right? <clears throat> Oh my god. That's Papa Doc. This is Baby Doc. That's Papa Doc. I had no idea. Uh, Francois de Vier or whatever the fuck their fucking French last. This is Papa Doc. I knew Baby Doc. I hadn't. I, dude, no idea. No idea it was Baby Doc. Uh, Papa Doc. Jesus Christ. Um, all right. I gotta work off like shapes and shit sometimes. <laughs> Alfredo 
Alfredo Stresner? S T R O E S S N E R Stresner? Alfredo Stresner? Um, Paraguay, thirty-four to eighty-nine. Uh, I'm sorry, fifty-four to eighty-nine. Decent run though. Um, I think the cutoff for this list. <sighs> yeah, it's three. It's it's got to be here. It's got to be here. Paraguay. Happy zippy. I'll lean into it as far. Um, I, I don't know. It's it's four five three four. I don't know. This doughy ass is gonna be so boring in bed. He seems fun. Who is he? Cook Islands. What did he get up to? What did um, what did uh, Albert Henry in the Cook Islands get up to? How bad of a fucking dictator was he? I don't know anything about this motherfucker. Creepy Gabriel? Yeah, I'd fuck him. Yeah, he give me a fucking he give me a Werther's original afterwards. Be fine. <laughs> you think sad face? Oh no no no! Pound pound! I literally put sad <laughs> sad sad face McInbred. I put him in six just to ensure that he'd get like laid, right? I feel like I feel like we could fucking make him happy, and maybe he wouldn't be a dictator anymore. It seems to me that this dude just needed one good nut, and and that's just so I I was putting him up here just to make sure he got laid. It, it, Five, five, six, whatever the, wherever the cutoff is, just consider him to be at the level of the cutoff for getting fucked. Because I just, I feel like we might be able to turn that one around. He was, what was he? He was uh, Castaneda, Castaneda. He was uh, Guatemala. Yeah, I feel like we could, might have saved Guatemala a lot of fucking heartache. We could have, we could have just fucked that one out. It's a pity fuck. It is. It's a pity fuck. It's a pity fuck. It is. It is a hundred percent a pity fuck. It is, it is what it is, man. Fucking, um, Gustavo Rojas Pinilla. Pinilla. Colombia. The only thing that can defeat a dictator, post-nut clarity. Dude, Caboose, did you see that post-nut clarity on Reddit? Fucking, like, the most epic post-nut clarity ever. A uh, kid was, um, feeling suicidal. He went and laid down on the train tracks, and while he was waiting for the train, he, yeah... Yeah, he got bored, so he rubbed one out, and in his post nut clarity, he's like, dude, what the fuck are you doing? Just get up. And he fucking saved his life. Um, best best fucking post nut clarity ever. Yeah. Uh alright, so yeah, Columbia, dude, this 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 dude's just got mm -mm, I ain't letting him anywhere near me. Like I said, I don't like the accoutrement. Um just no. Fucking just no. Uh, what the fuck are you? Yeah, that was Diaz. That was Mexico. Um, fuck, this is just way too much work. Just way too much work. Scissors. Baby Doc! Uh, this guy's a psychopath. Like, proper. You don't want to be in this dude's bed. Uh, Cook Island's guy wasn't too bad. Did steal an election or two. All right! All right, see, see, creepy grandpa's not that terrible. Fucking, you get, you get a Werther's original after you suck his dick. It's a good deal. Swindling some money, doing some voter fraud, but nothing too crazy. See? So like a typical American politician. All right. That is pretty much par for the course then. Yeah, like this motherfucker? Mm, don't lay down with him. He's just Maduro is just gonna lay there and be a lazy a lazy lay. You know he is. You know he is. Just gonna fucking lay there and be like, ride me. 
And you're like, oh, yay. I get to fucking climb on top of some fat motherfucker and bounce on his three-inch baby dick for a, for a while. <laughs> yeah, Maduro doing that dead fish impression. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I don't, but apparently some people do call them pillow princesses. Um, socialism. Everyone has to do the work. Yeah, he didn't believe in socialism. He was an oligarch. What's up, Alex? We're do we're doing another dictator's t uh, hot or not tier list. They're already they're already tiered out. Um, fucking, I sorry. This batch, I I Pinochet was getting in the getting the hottest. Um, fucking, I dude, dude, I fucking people people still give me. I, occasionally, somebody will fucking mention that shit. Fucking the the uh, the Che Guevara thing. Some people are still fucking mildly annoyed that they're like, why the fuck did you put Che so low? Put him at the same level as Donald Trump, I think. Anyway, who is this motherfucker? Jorge Rafael Videla, Argentina. 76 to 81. He'd be to say slap your ass in your face. Yeah, he would. But you know what? It's going to be some good goddamn dick. That, dude, that dude's going to throw it in you. Yeah, that dude's going to fucking put some work in. So, you better be ready for round two and three probably too. Oh no! Yeah, uh, uh, Alex, you're literally the like second or third person to say they all look like potatoes. I'm not kidding you. you. No, no, no. Other people have said that as well, and I don't disagree. It's it's a rough list. It's a rough list, dude. It's it's a rough list. I mean, when you're working with fucking Baby Doc and fucking Maduro and shit. All right, fucking um, yeah, we did uh, fucking Videla, uh, Videla uh, Argentina. And who is Hattie McGee here? King George Tupu V, Tonga, 2006 to 2012. Oh, he doesn't he look happy too? Hang on, can we get a little closer on this? Oh, God damn it. Yeah, he, he looks like a real happy camper. Wait, I have the fucking, why am I? God damn it, Kai. Fucking dumbass. Um, There it is. Uh, yeah. Yes, 2006 to 2012. A few of these are recent. I mean, Maduro was recent. Um, Raul's recent. I mean, Pinochet's in the 90s. Ortega was recent, too. Ortega's still going. Like, um, yeah. Ortega's still going, but... Yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, it's fucking Tonga. I mean, you know. He looks like he's going on a racist safari trip. I mean... Do we know if he was going on a racist safari trip? <laughs> it's a distinct possibility. Oh, thank you, Marcus. We have two more of those, courtesy of Marcus as well. 